All right, guys. If you've been around for a little while, you might remember the white 300X I brought home. Well, this is the replacement. <laughs> it's not in much better shape, but it's in better shape. Let me give you guys a look around real quick. But yeah, I wouldn't have mind keeping or keeping the white car, but it was just, man, it did a lot of work. It's kind of like in the same condition that that white FD was in. And man, I don't know if I got that in again. That was a lot of work to do out here in the yard without having like a shop and proper tools. So this one might be a better starting point, but it's kind of disgusting. That was a new noise. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how this thing got so far gone it looked like it was a really really nice car this window's off track so i imagine that's how most of this water damage got in here but it's not too bad the carpet's not like falling apart the seat's not falling apart and usually when a car gets really bad water damage all this stuff will start to rot and it'll just be gone but it's not too bad it's savable i think but i mean it is it is pretty disgusting the driver's side window was down as well, but for what I don't know why, because it rolled up perfectly fine. But it's not missing a lot of stuff. The previous owner said he was just going down the road and the car shut off. Um, the time of belt still on this, so I checked that. It's on both cams. So I'm pretty sure that's not the case, but you never know. Um, someone stole a bunch of the relays off of it, stole the starter off of it. But the body's pretty straight. I think the only really bad damage is like right over here, which it's it's pretty bad, but you know, it's definitely fixable. That's not too bad. And my favorite thing about this car, look at that. Yes, sir, it is a slick top, hard top, whatever you want to say. And that little little dent right there bugs me. Kind of kind of a bummer. And for some reason, the store's locked. Hmm. But yeah. All right, let's crawl, crawl through this old girl. What is it with Nissan and their door handles falling off? That is the craziest thing I've ever seen in my life. Every Nissan I've ever had, that that's like a thing. But as you can see, that's it's pretty nasty over here. There's not really sense to open it. Yeah, that's gross. Yeah, we're gonna start off, you know, start off with the usual. I'm just gonna vacuum all the loose debris out, get all the big pieces of trash out of this thing, and uh, just clean it up really good. Pressure wash it, and so I can kind of see exactly what we got. Um, just give you guys a better look at this side. So it's not like it's not too bad. You like usually get water damage, all this stuff just falls apart. I think I think it should clean up pretty good. That's disgusting. But I'm not scared of it. I'll get it back on the road, even if it does need like serious engine work. Um, I've always wanted a 300 zx since I was like 15, maybe 14 years old. Like I remember reading articles in these about these things. Dude, I just I'm a big 300 zx fan. Which you would wouldn't know that because I got like a bunch of RX7s and all that stuff. But I think this is the most slept on car of the 90s. Like, I don't care. Everybody's always wanting Skylines and stuff like that. And FDs and Supras. I think these are awesome cars. But yeah, anyway, we'll get this thing cleaned up and we'll show you guys the finished results. And then in the next video, we'll start doing some stuff trying to figure out what's going on with this thing and try to get it running. But now the fun stuff starts. <sighs> Look at all this junk, bro. Yee. You know, I probably should get some gloves. Wait one second. All right, that's much better. You guys don't want to see this. Let me speed through this and just, what the, how the fuck, well, there's a rock in here. Piece of brick. Yeah, let me speed through this. You guys don't want to see all this crap. Ooh, somebody wanted this 10 piece. Cash had me 20 bucks. I'll send it to you. That's yummy. Last 
that's not good. Disgusting. Should be a drain hole somewhere in here. I've seen a lot of rodent poop. It's never a good thing. They like to eat stuff. Ooh. I think I found someone's 10 millimeter if they want it back. They can have it. There's our drain hole, I think. I do not want this puke nasty shit on me, man. This is disgusting. That's gross. Gross, 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 gross. Ooh. I wish you could smell this. This smells horrible. Hmm. All right, guys, it's actually the next day. I kind of ran out of daylight. But we did get the same pressure wash. It still got some some grit, slime on it and stuff, but it turned out a whole lot better. I'm gonna quit rambling and just let you guys check it out. Still got a long way to go, but it's better. So just like anytime you wash something's been sitting, like I said, um, some more flaws appeared <laughs> that I didn't see. It's kind of scuffed up. It's got like a lot of little little bad spots, but it's okay. I wasn't expecting it to be perfect. But look at the interior. It's still nasty. Still got some slime and stuff on it, but it's livable. Like you could actually sit in the car and not feel like you're you're about to uh I don't know, catch some kind of weird disease or something. But yeah. Still a long way to go, but like I said, it's it's cleaning up pretty good. I know with the RX-7, these covers are kind of rare and hard to find. I don't know if that's the same way with the 300s or not, but it's a little messed up. Ooh. I definitely see potential in it. Need some love, but you know, it's a, uh, it's an old car. I'm really curious to see uh, what stopped it, what caused it to quit running. But yeah, we'll get in that on the next video. Like I said, I gotta get a starter and get some relays and stuff, but Let's kind of get ahead of myself because, you know, I have like limited time, but I just wanted to show you guys the car before I started like messing with it and get it cleaned up and everything. But hope you'll stick around on the next video. We're going to try to get this thing running. I'm hoping it's something simple, stupid, but we'll find out for sure on the next video. See you guys.